Hello friends, welcome back to CAD Practice. Today we are going to construct a 3D model of this break in Autodesk Inventor software. So let's get started. Go to new, take a standard part in millimeter and go to create. Now take a 2D sketch. We'll select here the XY plane. Take the circle command. From the center point, make a circle of diameter 60. Okay. From same center, make one more die of 180 mm die. Okay. Now finish sketch. Here, take extrude command. Select this profile. Take here symmetric. And take a distance of 16 mm. Press OK. Now select this face. Go to create sketch. Take circle command. From this center point, make circle of diameter 100, enter, escape, select this profile, project, ok. So this will be considered with the sketch, finish sketch, take extrude, select this profile, take here extrude of 10 mm. This will be a joining profile and press ok. okay. Now here select this face, go to create sketch. Now take here circle command. From this center point, make circle of diameter 80. On this circle, we are going to construct the mounting circle of diameter 12. Now escape. Select this circle, make it construction geometry. Now go to vertical constraint, select this point and select this center. Now go to circular pattern, select this circle, go to axis and select this for axis of rotation. Here the count will be of 6, press ok, finish sketch, take extrude, select all the profiles, flip the direction and here I will change the uh, dimension to all and press ok. Ok, so this will be a through cut. Now here Go to origin, we will select the side view, the exit plane, go to create sketch. Now go to view, visual style, change it to shaded with hidden edges. Go to sketch, take rectangle command, take two point rectangle. Here make the rectangle profile, go to dimension, define this dimension as 20. And define this width as 8. Now go to vertical constraint. Sorry, the horizontal constraint. Select the green point and select this yellow center point. Go to line command. Make a center line from the center point. Okay, and escape. Select this line. Make it construction. Finish sketch. Take here revolve command. Profile is selected for axis, select this as axis of rotation. Click here for cut and press OK. OK, sorry. Here we'll go to angle and take angle of 15 degree. And here we'll click on symmetric and press OK. <coughs> so this will be the profile. Now here rotate the profile. We are going to make the radius in inner edges. Select this edge, go to fillet, take a fillet radius of 2 mm. Now select all the other edges like this, select this, and select this. Press OK, rotate the view. Okay, go to home view. Now go to circular pattern, select revolve 1, fillet 1. Go to rotation axis, select this as axis of rotation, take here count of 16, press ok, ok. Now here, select this face, go to create sketch, here go to arc command, take 3 point arc, select this center point and here select any of the circumference. Go to dimension. Define the radius here, 
of 20, 80, sorry 80. Select this center point, select this center. The vertical height here will be of 30 and scale. Select this outer profile, make it construction. Select this, make it construction. Here, go to circle command. Make one circle here, second circle here, and third circle here. Go to dimension, define this 7.5. Escape. Select this circle, press control, press equal constraint, select this, select this, and select this. So all the three circles of dia, 7.5. Go to dimension. Here, define the center distance, define this distance as 10, define this distance here as 12, <coughs> okay, <coughs> now here go to vertical constraint, select this point and select this point, so all are defined now, okay. Now finish sketch, here go to extrude, select all three circles, flip the direction to cut and here take all. So this will be a through cut, press ok. Now here go to circular pattern, select extrude 4, go to rotation axis, select this, take here count of 18 and press ok. okay. Go to view, visual style, change it to shaded with edges. Okay, so this will be the view. Now here, you want a groove here. Go to part 1. You also have a groove here. Okay. Go to part you are making. Select the visor plane. Go to create sketch. Here, take the circle command. Make the circle here. Of dia 4, go to horizontal constraint. First, go to project geometry, project this, escape, go to coincident, select this point, and here select the green point of this line. This is constrained now. Finish sketch, go to 3D model, revolve, profile is selected. Now we have not made any axis here. Okay. So for axis, we have three already made axis. So we'll select here Z axis and click on cut. So a groove will be cut here. Press OK. OK. Now we are going to give the radius now. Go to fillet and here take radius 2. Select here radius 2. OK. And OK. Now here go to chamfer, give here chamfer, give here chamfer, this and ok, ok, go to part 1, I hope you have completed all, ok, so these are the radius, ok, go to part 1 again, okay. now go to finish, so we will give here the chrome finished, chrome polished, so this will be the final output. So this was a basic tutorial to how to construct a this break in Autodesk in Inter software. I hope you like the video. If you do that, please do it like and subscribe the channel for more such videos. Thank you.